Yeah, thank you so much. Wow, it's nice. Gracias. <laughs> Good morning, guys. How you doing? So as you saw, that was Javier delivering breakfast. That's one thing that comes with room, as Airbnb is breakfast, I guess, in your room. So pretty nice, man. Tortillas with eggs and looks like ketchup or salsa. Not bad. Super nice guy. Very. I would say, if I haven't met a, I've never met a guy, a, a grown man with such a child's heart like young at heart he's like a i look at him he, was, he he reminds me of like a how he was when he was 10 years old probably he's still that way and it's amazing i love it his energy is great um so if you guys were to come to Guadalajara, you want to have a inexpensive place to stay that's the bed is comfortable the shower works toilet everything works right it's not glamorous all you gotta do is watch out if you're tall if you're above five nine watch out for this uh door when you step on don't step here if you I hit my head already twice. But this is a great place to stay anyways. I'm eating my breakfast, I'm packed up, and I'm going to my next destination, going to the bus station to head to Guanajuato, Mexico. We'll see what that has to offer. I don't know, let me know in the comments what you guys think, have you guys been there, and, and all that good stuff, so stay tuned. Javier. Si, sí, señor. Es una pregunta. ¿Cómo llego a...? ¿Qué, qué, qué terminal voy para llegar a Guan Guanajuato? Guanajuato. Sí. Terminal Nueva le llamamos nosotros. Terminal este, Nueva. Ajá. Traes Uber, metes ahí Central Camionera y te va a aparecer Tlaquepaque. Tla Tlaque. Tlaquepaque. Ponlo yo te oriento. Ah, bueno. Está bien. Te cobran 100... 100 pesos más o menos. 100 pesos. ¿Y los buses salen cada rato a Guanajuato? ¿O qué? ¿O usted sabe? Ah, supongo que sí. Uh, sí. Arturo, ¿los autobuses para Guanajuato salen seguido? Creo que sale uno a la una y media. Una y media. ¿De las once? ¿Ahorita? Ajá. Ah. A las 11. Ah, bueno, voy a salir Tienes entonces. Tienes suficiente tiempo. Sí, claro. Pues muchas gracias por el, el cuarto y todo. Sí. Dime. Otra opción. Sí, dime. O sea, ahí te van a decir, sale a las 11. Ajá. Pero hay uno ahorita a León. Ajá. Te va a decir la muchacha ahí, tomas el camión a León y ahí en León cada, cada 15 minutos salen para Guanajuato. León ah. es la ciudad de... es la capital, la capital de Guanajuato. ¿Y esa eso ciudad es muy bonito? ¿León? No, no. Es una ciudad. Sí, no. Bueno, de, es subjetivo, ¿no? O sea, depende. Para él a lo mejor ha tenido malas experiencias. Depende de cómo te vaya en la feria. Ajá. Para mí todo es bello. Ah, bueno, entonces otra opción es ir a León y luego eh, tomar un bus desde León a Guanajuato. No, no, cada bueno, 15 minutos. Que... Y se, se, se saldría, minutos. saldría como el mismo precio en total. No. Ah, sí. O sea, si tomas el camión de aquí a Guanajuato, es igual que tomar de aquí a León y luego de León a Guanajuato, mismo precio. Cinco Más pesos. aventura. Ah, Más perfecto. Menos. Y, y ese desde acá a León sale cada rato también, cada... Eh, eh, sale más seguido. Más seguido. seguido. Perfecto, me suena bien. <risa> pues... Sí, ¿Qué? porque el grosso total de salidas es ahorita de las 11 a las 4 de la tarde. Sí. Son, 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 son ah, ok. Y ahí en León, el último que sale para Guanajuato sale a las 9 y media Ajá. de la noche. Pero son cada 30 minutos. ¿Cuánto tiempo desde acá a León para llegar en bus? ¿Ya te subiste? Ajá. ¿Dos horas? Dos horas, 40 minutos. ¿Y León a Guanajuato? León a Guanajuato es como media hora. Ah, es muy rápido, es muy rápido. Son, ah, bien. Ahora verás. Son como 30 kilómetros. Perfecto. Perfecto, ese es el plan entonces. Muy bien. Guanajuato muy bien. Ah, gracias, sí, sí. Varios días allí. Vale. Sí, sí, voy como unos días allá y luego, después uh, San Miguel de Allende para conocer. Mejor. Eso. <risa> Más viejitos. Ajá. Pero... Él conoce mucho del país. Ah, ok. Bueno, de esa parte. Sí. De ese par ¿Qué otros lugares debo, debo conocer por acá? No, pues es que no. no. Sí. Aquí es... Guanajuato, San Miguel de Allende, Ajá. Este, Ciudad Puebla, Ajá. Ciudad de México, no sé si la conozco. Ya, con, ya conocí México, ya conocí Puebla. Bueno, de este lado es este San Cristóbal de las Casas en Chiapas. En Chiapas. Ah, Chiapas. Sí. Okay. Turista? Sí. 
San Cristóbal de las Casas en Chiapas. Y es más barato. Mucho ah, joven. Es bueno. de todo el, mucho joven. Todo europeos. Ah, perfecto. De Debo, debo llegar hasta ahí. ¿Cómo se llama la plata? La plata, en la ciudad de La Plata, este. ¿En España? No, me aquí abajo. Es este. Bueno, San Cristóbal de las Casas. Muy bien. Ah, ok. Y. Aquí es Sayulita, la, la plaza es Sayulita, en la, en la playa, Ajá. Aquí, 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 en, aquí en Jalisco, Sayulita. Sa la playa, una, sí, la ok. Playa. Pero ahorita ven, León, Guanajuato, Guanajuato está muy bien ahorita. Ok. Y, este, y de ahí te puedes ir a San Cristóbal de las Casas. Ah, pero muy lejos ese trayecto, ¿no? Ah, sí. Sí, muy lejos. Es que el, el viaje es así. Krill. Ajá. Cerca de Chihuahua. Ajá. Zacatecas. Ajá. Guadalajara. Guanajuato. San Cristóbal de las Casas. Este, Guanajuato, San Miguel de Allende. San Cristóbal de las Casas. Ajá. Y, y ahí es la zona maya. Ajá. La zona maya, es, 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 ahí se quedan todos. Ah, bueno. En la zona maya. Sí, claro. Pues, no, yo ando sin plan, nomás conociendo el país. Bueno, sin plan, es ese, no, ese es un plan, plan muy bueno. Sí, sí. Pues, las playas, pues ahí en... Ese, la, la zona maya la, eh, Ah, bueno. Gracias. 3 litros de Tiner del Nacional con Paco. Con los muchachos. Sí, Ahorita nos vamos. Gracias. Bueno, voy a empacarme y pido el Uber pa, pa, para hoy, para irme, sí. <risa> All right, guys, I got the Uber and it's gonna cost, uh, what's the guess? It's cost 145 pesos. So, to get to the terminal. Check it out, guys. It's a uh, thing to get the flies. Interesting. <laughs> so here's a tip for you guys. I ordered Uber and it's coming. It's, it's cost 140, 145 pesos, but there's two different applications I use here in, in Mexico. One is called Didi, D-I-D-I, -I, and now one's called InDriver. Uh, Javier just ran Didi to see how much it would cost, and that was actually 75 pesos. InDriver, you, you put your price and then the, the drivers kind of bid for it, and then the lowest bid wins or those price wins so those two options i use uber because my my card is attached to it and i like paying my card but if you want to save money uh dd is probably the better option or in driver so there you go now you know all right guys we got to the terminal i can't pronounce it i'm not even gonna try but there it is actually i'll try it took forever. It was a very far ride across the city. Buenas. Buen día. Buen día. Ah, gracias. Ah, sí. Sí. ¿Cómo funciona? No me agarre. Mueve la mano. Ah, está. Gracias. Okay. I think they said ETN is the best one to go to Guanajuato. Let me check. I'm gonna go talk to them. I hope this was the right uh, station to come to. Buenas, para Guanajuato. Guanajuato de aquí no salen, jefe, salen de la central grande nada más. ¿Central grande? Sí. ¿En serio? Sí. Ay, no, es que me dejaron acá. Es que se llama, está en la que y se, la gente piensa que es la que paque, pero no. Ah, es que son los dos mismos nombres. No, se llama Central Nueva. Central Nueva, está muy lejos. Sí. Una hora promedio. No. Ay, ¿Te no. ¿Te ayudo a pedirlo? ¿Cómo? ¿Te vas a pedir el Uber? Sí. ¿Te ayudo a pedirlo? Ah, ok, gracias. Ay, no. Horrible. Lo bueno que te pregunté. Sí, pero me dijeron dos personas para acá. No pasa nada. Lo bueno que todavía estás a tiempo. Pero pasa mi plata y pasa mi tiempo. Eso sí. Eso sí. No te preocupes, ahí cuando fui a Huascariente te perdí. Eh. Acá no sale. Ay, no. Y 
tampoco a, a ¿cómo se llama el otro ciudad? Eh, 129. León. Sí, nada más salen de allá. Ah, ok. Pero acá sale el león, vea. Sí. No, es, es ETN. Por eso. Aquí no podemos vender boleto y a borda allá. En serio. Tenemos los nombres. Si quieres preguntar para que vean. Ah, ok. Pero mejor irme directamente allá. ¿Ve? ¿Tienes al león de aquí? Pero voy a preguntar a ella primero. Por eso, dijo que no. De, que no, ah, no la escuché. A León no va. No va. Pero te puedes ir de la que está en Zapopan, Ajá. Eh, que está cerca del estadio de las Chivas. Sí, pero tienen más salidas allá. Ah, ah bueno, sí. sí la, la central, la otra, ahí tienen muchísimas salidas. Sí, tienen más salidas. Porfa. Sí, sí, acá duran más, pues vas a batallar. Ajá. Ah, ok, gracias. Muy amable. Sí, la pides, porfa. Okay, gracias. I know. Gracias. So there you go, guys. Javier is a great guy, very nice, but he's not, he kind of gives wrong information. So now I have to take the, the Uber to another station, Central. It looks like the Uber's coming, so. Ah, horrible, man. And I speak perfect Spanish and I asked the perfect question and they told me wrong. Ah, okay. Gracias. And they told me wrong. What a waste of money and time, man. Now I gotta take an Uber. One hour. Gracias. I, I took the Uber to get here from my Airbnb. It was like an hour to get here. Now I gotta take an Uber an hour back. I probably could have gone from my Airbnb to the one that in... Uh, Terminar Centro, like maybe in 20 minutes, man. But whatever, it's part of traveling, part of the experience. Just gotta live and learn, you know? So by you guys watching my channel, you guys get to see my mistakes and not make the same mistakes. And it was both, it was Javier and the other guy who told me this station. They both told me, so. But I went on Google and I tried to research it. And on Google, it didn't give me that much information. It actually didn't tell me what station to go through. So, I guess that's why channels like mine exist. So I could be on boots on the ground and learn it for you guys. So you guys can learn. And again, I want to thank, well, I never, I never thanked for I, I want to thank my Patreon supporters because you guys supported me, helped me with these mistakes I make and actually getting this information out for you guys. So let's see, is that my Airbnb? I mean, not Airbnb, it's my Uber. No, not yet, that's not it. Mine's a black one. It's coming. I don't know if you can see it. But uh, yeah, you guys supporting on Patreon and my PayPal donations uh, is really, really helping me. And also helping me give a job to a young University student who who is editing my videos, helped me in my videos. So I greatly appreciate you guys. Anybody who wants to support, I appreciate as well. As all links in the descriptions, links in the descriptions as always. All right, stay tuned. So one benefit of this happening is I get to see the whole, the literally the whole city of Guadalajara by car <laughs> to get to get my my full valuation. Actually, I think I'm going back the same route, literally going to. Uh, where I was again I make the mistake so you guys don't have to so stay tuned all right guys so we're in the terminal central and the, the uber told me Primera Plus is the best company to go with so I'm gonna go here and check it out let's see what they say Hmm. 
I hope that yeah, there's Leon, there's Guanajuato right there. Leon, Guanajuato is four, five forty pesos. These at nine, these at one, and then Leon, like the other guy told me, uh, he was totally wrong, man. These at four, oh four in the morning. Okay, yeah, at least a whole lot faster. Let's go ask. Buenos días. Después quiero llegar a Guanajuato. Pero una pregunta, ese sale, el próximo sale a la, a la una, ¿sí? Sí. Entonces, la, ¿puede ser como irme a, a León y desde León a Guanajuato? ¿Es más rápido? Sí. Y a pues, León sales ahorita a las 11.40. Pero sal, saldría como el mismo precio en total, o más costoso. No, te cuesta casi lo mismo. Casi lo mismo. Ah, es casi igual. Ajá. Entonces cuando yo llego al León nomás bajo y saco un uh, pago un boleto y eh, ahí sale más frecuente. Ahí hay más líneas distintas de con nosotros mismos. Perfecto. Por para León. ¿Me permites una identificación? Claro. Ah, ese es de Colombia. ¿Qué número de asiento? ¿Perdón? ¿Número de asiento? Es, es los azules, ¿sí o no? Okay. No, que tiene número. ¿Cualquier número? Eh, me da 27. ¿27? Sí, porfa. 439. Ok. Gracias. Alright, so that gentleman was correct when he told me it's better to go to Leon and then from Leon go to Guanajuato. Otherwise, I'll be waiting here for like three hours. So, yeah. And it comes out to be about the same price. I also saw these um, empanadas, but whatever. I want to go to the gate and wait. I think she said this way. I can never understand when they tell me which gate, but from three to nine, I have no idea what that means. But whatever, we'll figure things out. That's why learning Spanish is very important. Check out the link below. Check out the link below for um, the school I recommend to learn Spanish online, unlimited classes. So she pointed this way. Hmm. Ah, okay. Yeah, here's the entrance. So they got subway if you guys like subway. There it is. But I wonder if there's bathrooms there. I might go to the restroom before I go in. Yeah, I'll do that. I want to get breakfast, but I'm not sure what I want. Let's see. We got huevos for the huevos al gusto. Huh. What do I order? Buenas. Buenas. Pido acá o en la mesa? En la mesa, joven. Ah, ok. Hey. Gracias. Si hay mesa, no hay mesa. Mm. Ah, ya no hay mesa. Sí, ya se lo traigo. Ah, bueno. Mm. No, nope, no table. So I guess I'm going to wait to eat until I get over there in León. ¿Qué tal? Buen día. Eh, me da huevos al gusto, porfa. Hay con chorizo, con tocino, con jamón a la mexicana, ranchero. Con chorizo. Algo de beber. ¿Qué tienen para beber? Agua de pepino, agua de jamaica, eh, refresco, café, cappuccino, jugo de lata, manzana y durazno. ¿No tienen chocolate caliente? Chocolate, sí, también le mato más chocolate. Sí. Eh, Ah, no, uh, ¿qué, ¿qué aguas tiene otra vez? Espino y Jamaica. Jamaica, porfa. ¿Es todo? Sí, es todo, gracias. All right, guys, so I'm hoping that you guys are learning Spanish with me because I'm, speak, I'm turning the camera on when I'm talking to people now more so you guys can hear my interactions. But um, get some eggs in me. 
and then for the long haul, I'm not sure how long the trip is. I think it's like two or three hours. I'm not sure. It's not that long at all. But uh, whatever. So stay tuned. I'll show you the eggs. It looked good. I saw the people eating. And uh, I'll be back. Stay tuned. I tell you what, though, I missed the. Um, hold on. I missed the uh, the hot chocolate in Oaxaca with the bread. That's some good hot chocolate. If you guys go to Oaxaca, definitely drink hot chocolate. Maybe I made a bad decision ordering food. It's 11.07. The bus leaves at 11.40. I haven't got my food yet. I'm going to have to wolf it down. And the bad thing is I'm not even hungry. I'm, this, is, this is pure gluttony because I'm bored. So I'm eating. Okay, get back on my intermittent fasting. It was hard doing intermittent fasting at, in Guadalajara in this place because they were serving me breakfast. It, I don't know if you guys ever done intermittent fasting before, but once you eat something, your appetite opens. You know, so once I get to the next destination, Guanajuato, I'll get back to intermittent fasting and eat at lunch, one like two meals a day, and keep dropping that weight. But anyways, hope the food comes. Hope I uh, don't miss my bus because I. You guys saw what I went through. I had to go across town to the wrong terminal and then come back across town to this terminal. And in the worst case scenario, if I missed the freaking bus. Yeah. We'll see what happens. Another tip that I forgot to tell you. Guys, I like to pay with my credit card whenever I can, especially like in Mexico. Um, yeah, mostly when I, yeah, when I'm traveling, I try to pay with my credit card as much, like, much as I can. So I have a Capital One 360. They don't charge international fees. And when you pull from the ATM, they charge big fees. The ATM does usually. So just to stay away from those big fees. And when I do pull from the, when I do pull from the ATM, I pull as much as I can and just store it uh, and use it as I need it. But here comes the food. Let's see. All right. Gracias. Perfect. Ay, que bueno. Gracias. So there you go. Salsa picoso. Got the bread, no tortillas, but it's hot. Nice hot bread. So this is this is terminal food. Let's see if the terminal food is good. Cause I had experience in Cali, Colombia, and the food was horrible and very expensive. So this, this is well priced, and let's see if it's tasty. All right, I don't know if you guys can see me, but even before I try, I'm gonna get the salsa. When I first came to Mexico, I wasn't used to the salsa anymore. I was living in Colombia for so long. My taste buds were used to Colombian food. But now I'm getting slowly but surely back to being used to uh, Mexican food. My friends back in Texas were, they made fun of me when I told them I couldn't handle the, all the different flavors here in Mexico anymore. But let's see, now they should be proud. Beans. All right. Eggs. better but it's good it's decent let's see the bread bread's good all right let me enjoy my meal i got a rush it's 11 11 and then we'll catch the bus stay tuned all right guys so that meal was uh with the breakfast and the drink it was 68 pesos not bad so let's go check in. I like to get to my bus early. That way if there's any kind of confusions or I misunderstand something, I have time to, to adjust, you know? So I like to get to my station or the door or whatever on time. Let's see if this is the right one. Buenas. Gracias. Is this Aliano para Guanajuato? Oh no, uh, Leon, see? Okay, gracias. Oh, so much alcohol. So much alcohol in the hands, man. But it's good. Oh, well, whatever. Guys, this is the Premier Plus uh, bus line. I, I saw it inside a little bit. It looks super nice. So I'll show you on a bit. Stay tuned. Got these wooden steps, man. Not bad. It smells nice in here, too. Like a spa. 27. Yeah, it's got wooden stuff. It smells like a, a sauna. 
kind of feels like a sauna. It's pretty hot. I'm right here, but you see these nice cushions. These are nice. This is nothing like the Greyhound in the States, huh? Man, America needs or United States needs a step up. Let's see, let me see my bag fits here. Ah. Wait, hold on, let's see. Wow, look at this. Oh, I should have picked this one. This was an option. It's all by itself. Nice bathrooms. Mm-hmm. Not bad. What do you guys think? And each one has a uh, the TV to watch. This is nice. And for 439 pesos. So let's check out the uh right here has we put this thing down for your legs and then you recline here. I think. Oh that's not that's a seatbelt. How do you do this thing? There it is. There it is. Ah, what we call in Colombia Montañero. There we go. Ah, doesn't come up. But uh, a little bit too fancy for me, huh? Ah, there we go. So I got my legs up. That's the worst thing about, one of the worst things about riding a bus is your legs get tired because they're just hanging, right? And the blood flow goes down. But here, it's almost like a lazy boy recliner. Not bad. A little bit too narrow for my shoulders, but it's all good. I should have picked the one in the back. Next time I know. All right, stay tuned. All right, guys, so now I'm in uh, Leon. Just got to pick a bus to take me to Guanajuato. There's 96 pesos right there for this same bus. It's an hour ride. I'm going to look at the other businesses, see if they, uh, they have a little bit cheaper and save some money. It's 96 pesos uh, in the company I went with, so let me go with that company. All right, guys, my bus leaves in at 3:15. It's 2:55. I got it for cheaper. I got it for 60. Economic. Not bad. What else? All right, so we continue. It's not as pretty as the other bus. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's this blue bus right here. Older, it's the economic bus. That's why it's cheaper, 60 pesos, not bad. But at least I'm not waiting from one bus to the next bus. Almost to the journey, it's only like an hour ride. Y'all can see the difference. <laughs> Big difference. But it's all good. Still gets the same spot. All right, guys, I made it to Guanajuato. There's the outside take a taxi or uber it's like 15 minute ride to my airbnb in the downtown let's see how how we like one i want those stay, stay tuned 